Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, sorry magulo yung aso. So yun, so for today's video, I'm going to share to you my experience um, having the second dose of my COVID-19 vaccine which is the AstraZeneca. So actually mamaya, meron akong mag, mag, ano, ako, inoculate na ng second dose of AstraZeneca. And then, I'll keep you posted for at least 5 days, 5 to 7 days. Tignan natin kung hanggang kailan mo wala yung side effects. Sana meron. Ay, sana wala pala. Or kung meron man yun. So, um, the end of my, uh, the end of this video is the last day kung saan ko experience or kung kailan ko experience yung side effects for the second dose. So, I'll see you guys after 5 to 7 days. Day 1, post-vaccination of AstraZeneca. So, after the inoculation or after giving or receiving the AstraZeneca, uh, vaccination, um, I noticed na hindi siya ganun kalala yung side effects compared to my first dose. So, yeah. So, same thing din naman after after injection. So, yun nga, meron, meron siyang slight tenderness sa ano, sa injection site. Pero, um, so far ha, within 24 hours, I don't experience chills or um, fever, feverish or um, fever-like. Tapos walang muscle pain, walang body pains, walang headache, walang lightheadedness, walang dizziness. So hopefully, after these 24 hours, on my 48 hours, sana wala na siyang, wala, wala siyang side effects na ma-experience. So I'll see you tomorrow. Hi guys, this is day 2 or 48 hours after a COVID-19 vaccination of AstraZeneca. So ngayon, <coughs> <clears throat> may halak. So, ngayon, um, luckily, wala akong ibang side effects na naramdaman. So, nag-take lang naman ako ng biogesic yesterday. So, at least parang mga naka-3 biogesics at ako. And then, ang natitira na lang ngayong um, side effects or kung ano man yung nararamdaman ko is the slight tenderness. Actually, slight to none nga eh, na, <clears throat> na tenderness sa injection side. So, aside from that, wala na. So, hopefully, um, after 72 hours or 72 hours after post-vaccination, wala na. So, if ever man na after 72 hours, wala na akong maramdaman, I'll stop um, shooting or I'll, I'll stop updating you. So, um, it's a good reference din naman 72 hours after post-vaccination. At least malalaman nyo or at least you have a good idea naman um, what to expect or what to experience on your second dose of AstraZeneca. This is 72 hours post AstraZeneca vaccination. Almost to none. Actually, konting-konti na lang yung injection site pain na naramdaman ko on my left arm. As Aside from that, um, I don't experience or I haven't experienced chills, fever, muscle ache, body pains, joint pains, dizziness, headache. Ano ba ba? Yun. So, yun kasi usually naramdaman ko on my first dose. So, ngayon, um, luckily, wala talaga siya. And then, upon assessing din naman, and upon um, asking then with my, my my colleagues who received the second dose of AstraZeneca, actually, halos wala din naman silang naramdaman na side effects na compared to their first one or first dose. So, sana talaga or actually ako sa akin ano ko thankful ako na hindi ganun ganun kalala yung side effects kasi um, malala talaga yung side effects ko on my first dose so if you haven't watched that video so you can check my my previous video on the AstraZeneca first dose so this is the the update or or the video I'm doing is for the second dose of AstraZeneca yung so like I, what I've said before the the best vaccine is the one that is available so um, if you're not yet decided which vaccine to um, to get, actually, kahit ano naman talaga, um, regardless if it is Sinovac, Sputnik, um, AstraZeneca, uh, Moderna, or Pfizer, actually, ang pinakamaganda talaga dun is the one is available kasi it gives you 100% um, assurance na hindi ka magkakaroon ng severe symptoms um, when you get COVID-19 infection. Parang ganun. So, yeah, so I'm encouraging everyone na wag na tayong mamili kung anong vaccine ang kukunin natin kasi um, lalo na ngayon sa atin sa situation natin sa Philippines we have numerous numbers of 
um, vaccine, different brands. Hindi naman tayo katulad ng mga first world country na isang brand lang. So ngayon, kasi staggered yung delivery ng vaccine sa atin dito sa Philippines or staggered din yung um, brand ng vaccine na dumadating sa atin. So kung aning available, get it. So wag na kayong magdalawang isip na kumuha or hindi kumuha, parang ganun. Kasi nga, and uh, it gives you um, an immunity then or a protection then uh, for the severe symptoms of COVID-19. So yun yung pinaka-importante. If ever man na magkaroon, mahawa tayo ng COVID-19 or ma ma-infect tayo ng COVID-19, at least alam natin na hindi siya magiging severe. Nasa mild to moderate lang siya. Which does not require hospitalization. So yun yung pinaka-ayaw natin eh. Kasi medyo mahal ang magpa-hospitalize ngayon due to COVID. Kasi malaki talaga yung ginagastos. Pero at least, if ma-infect tayo, uh, may chance pa rin naman talaga na ma-infect. Pero alam natin na mild to moderate lang siya. Which is, uh, kaya siyang uh, i-treat sa bahay. Just monitoring lang or supplemental medicines, parang ganun. At least hindi tayo mag oxygen requiring na hindi natin kailangan magpa-admit sa hospital. Yun yung pinaka-importante. So if you like this video, please don't forget to give give this video a thumbs up and then if you have comments if you have questions regarding the second dose of astrazeneca or even the first dose you can leave your comment on the comment section and then you can share this video i'm happy if you will share this video to parang ano rin, advertise and then to encourage people then to receive their first dose or even their second dose of vaccine and then if you haven't subscribed yet to my youtube channel it's hex or beta you can follow me on my instagram account it's hecky hex and then my facebook page is hex or beta so, yun lang. Take care. God bless. Stay safe. Stay home. And thank you. Hex. Bye-bye daw. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>